Well, everybody, this is Read Outlaws No Prep Talk. Today we're going to talk about Giuseppe Gentile's new No Prep Kings Mustang. Very, very nice car. Now, for the goes rugby to their front owners, please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Street Outlaws No Prep Kings race series and all the other Street Outlaw shows. So, Giuseppe Gentile, or Gentile, whichever is the right way to say it, he made a strong showing back in season three. Three years ago in 2019. In his twin turbo Hemi Mustang. He actually went to a couple of finals I believe. I know the first race of season 3. He went to the finals against Ryan. And he lost. But this was a very very competitive car in season 3. In season 4 I believe he made a couple of appearances. At some of the races. But now he is coming back. And he is coming back with in my opinion. The most beautiful car on NPK and I say it because I really like the S550's Mustangs and I love the screw blowers I said it when I saw the uh, uh, Team Game Changers new S550 Mustang for NPK as well but this one has a screw blower and it looks amazing so it has a PSI C rotor supercharger which in my opinion is the baddest power adder ever and it's obviously running a Hemi, and I'm sure it makes a lot of horsepower. It's a proven combination on row prep and also in all the other drag racing forms. It's basically the most feared power adder, and there's a reason why it's not allowed in NHRA racing as of right now. And it's an S550 Mustang, and it just looks amazing. I really like those cars. They're still rare on the no prep scene. I mean, we have the Game Changer one and this one, but there's not a lot of them in the drag racing world, at least at this level. Now, the old Mustang was fast, but I'm sure it wasn't an updated NPK car. Right now, to be competitive on NPK, 9 out of 10 times you have to have... A purpose-built NPK car. You just can't get uh, a car that was built for something else and put big tires on it and run NPK and be competitive. It just doesn't work that way. There is specifics to building an NPK car. So I'm pretty sure that was the case with Giuseppe's Mustang, even though it was a very fast car. We've also seen him on Fastest in America recently in behalf of Team Cali. And Team Cali is getting really, really fast, both on the street and on the track. We're actually going to do another video tomorrow on Bodhi's new ride for NPK, which is pretty sick. So uh, hopefully Giuseppe will do really, really good with this Mustang. Screw blowers are very competitive this season, and I'm sure we're going to see one of them win this season as well.